Good morning, dogs. FAFSA, Hot Dog of the Week, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, and invisible, with liberty and justice for all. Do you need help filling out the free application for federal student aid? If so, Purdue Extension is hosting a FAFSA event on Tuesday, February 21st from 4.30 to 7.30 p.m. You must make an appointment before February 17th to attend. Please call or email Esmeralda Cruz. In honor of School Counseling Week, we'd like to extend a huge thank you to Mrs. Everett and Mrs. Sham. Student services can help you with college applications, completing your FAFSA to enter college, helping you seek out armed services, and scholarship applications. They work hard for us every day, so be sure to say thank you to them next time you see them. If you didn't know, yesterday was Emma Pillion Day. Now, we'll send it to Mayor Judy Sheets and her official proclamation yesterday. Um, whereas, Emma Pillion, senior, Frankfurt High School, won the 2023 Indiana High School Girls Wrestling 113 pound state wrestling title. And was the first girl ever to win the 113 pound Sagamore Conference champion in January of 2023. She's a dedicated student, athlete that started long before her senior year at Frankfurt High School. Emma started her wrestling career in middle school, taking the runner-up title during the middle school state wrestling finals. Whereas, Emma started her season unranked and ended up third in regionals before taking the state title from an undefeated and returning state champion from 2022. During the Sagamore Conference, Emma pitched all of her opponents in the first period. This included the championship match. Her outstanding record of 31-4 is a glimpse of Emma's passion for wrestling throughout this season. Whereas Emma tackles her day at 5 a.m. with weights and workouts with Simma Frankfurt High School alumni, she impressively continues her day going from classroom to classroom and then to practice. Before going home, Emma will mentor, mentor the middle school and underclassmen after practice. She knows the importance of not only developing her own leadership skills, but also helping her peers around her be the best they can be. Whereas Emma Pillion will complete her high school athletic career with multiple wrestling championships, awards, and recognition. She has earned a four-year letter in wrestling, two-year letter in volleyball, and is anticipating a four-year letter in softball after the spring season. Whereas Emma Pillion's dedication, perseverance, and determination will leave a legacy of excellence and commitment the importance and value of leadership on and off the mat. Emma represents one of the best in Frankfurt and inspires all of us to be better leaders. Now therefore, I, Judith Sheets, Mayor of the City of Frankfurt, together with the citizens of Frankfurt, Indiana, recognize Emma Pillion for her commitment as a student athlete and extend our gratitude for her dedication and do hereby proclaim January 23rd, 2023 as Emma Pillion Day. And witness whereof I have here in two of my hand this 23rd day of January, 2023. A huge, well deserved congratulations to Emma. And with that, we'll send it to Sports and Weather. What's up, dogs? Freshman boys basketball tonight against Danville here at home at 6, and the swim team travels to Kokomo. The meet begins at 6. Not much news for today, so I'm going to send it to Emily with your weather report. Good morning, dogs. We'll have quite the cloudy day today. We're currently sitting at 30 degrees and temperatures should be ranging from the low to upper 30s. But let's talk about a winter storm warning that Clinton County is going to experience later during midnight. It'll begin around 1 a.m. tonight and is predicted to possibly stop any time through Thursday afternoon or Friday morning. Snowfall will cause us to have wind gusts from 25 to 35 miles per hour. My weather map shows us that we'll have an accumulation of snow anywhere from five to eight inches of snow. I am hoping for a two hour delay tomorrow because I feel like we deserve a three day weekend next Friday. That's all I got for today's news. I'll see you guys soon. This week's hot dog of the week is Oscar Flores, Ashley Zhang, Sebastian Holsinger, Keats Pippinger, and Mr. Debris, congratulations. For lunch today, lines one and two are cheeseburgers, lines three is spicy chicken, and lines four is quesadilla. 
We don't have any birthdays for today. That's all for today's news. And have a great Tuesday, dogs.